Welcome back. We are almost done with World 3 2. All that's left is raiding the new area, getting up to where the boss is, and then we deal with the man eater. More bug things in the meantime. If this is your first time... Wait, have I gone on spiel about the man-eater yet? I honestly can't remember. Regardless, if this is your first time playing, the boss of 3-2 is the one most likely to tear you in one, or beat you up worse than all the others because of the nature of the fight. See, the man-eater isn't just a one-on-one. -on -one. It starts off that way. But after about two minutes, or until you get the man eater down to about half health or something, his buddy comes in. And he's ident identical to the first one, except for current HP value, of course. So you gotta kill one, then you gotta kill the other. If you're not prepared for it, this can easily end up becoming overwhelming. And even then, the battlefield is essentially like where we are right now, except a little bit wider. And the Maneater does have attacks that can knock you flying, so you can also get killed by falling off the edge. So it can be a very challenging fight. It's the only boss that has consistently managed to kill me once on every playthrough. So I don't really like him all that much. Anyway, new area, sort of. Lots of storied soldier souls. Lots of these things dropping mercury stone. The stone of ephemeral eyes. Some of these things are awe inspiringly stupid and pretty much ignore you as we've already shown. That is the main reason to come down here. The Ring of Avarice. An additional 20% that will lead to all souls gained. And it stacks with the silver bracelets. Now that gold mask and to be... Actually, I don't know how to pronounce that, so apologies if I mispronounced it. But that rapier is notable in that... One thing I think you needed for the soldier's trophy, and... I think it also deals some additional fire damage. Maybe it's additional magic. I don't remember. I don't really pay that much attention to rapiers. And the gold mask is an item you can trade to the crow in World 4. Anyway, now we just have to get up to the boss, and there's only one more enemy between us and the main eater. And that is another Black Phantom Mind Flayer. And I do not have anti-magic field to render him into a wimp. And you can't roll up there like that. I'm not sprinting here because I don't recall if any more of those bug things spring up between us and the final flight of stairs. Wait, why am I using the plural? Bad habit of doing that. Anyway, before we go up the stairs, for one thing about just about any game, check under the stairs. Because they almost always stash the little nifty items back there. No, I'm just go up the stairs. See you, Mr. Elithid. You shall not feast upon my grace cranium stuff. Eh, 
let's try sniping him. This is bound to be hilarious. Got him! Oh crap. Okay. You okay, that's enough. Seriously? Okay. When you snipe ranged enemies, they often have a tendency to counterattack immediately. Problem is, mind flayers attack faster than, well, as you've seen, they attack faster than pretty much every other ranged enemy in the game so far. So, sniping them can be painful. By the way, these Black Phantom mind flayers always appear, no matter what world tendency you're at. Wait, you're supposed to keep walking. Oh, you little... I'll hit you eventually. Uh-huh. Okay. Like I said, that was probably going to be... Or that probably was... Hilarious, in a sense. rest of the stairs. I don't recall if there's another one. No, there's two mind flares and an archdemon. No, it doesn't look like there's another one. Very good, very good. Because I hate them. For some reason, I have no problem with the mind flare that was earlier in the level. But the one on the stairs almost always gives me trouble. I mean, especially the two after the man eater, and when you're going up to the archdemon. Anyway, storied soldier's soul, and we're pretty much right in front of the boss now. We just have one more item to collect, I believe. And then it is boss time. Hopefully, I will not die, because that would be bad, and sad. to do the boss fight, so I'm just going to run back in front of the fog, slap on my fragrant ring, and then go get something to eat, because I'm hungry. And i got to do something while waiting for my computer to restore. Or something like that. Anyway, until next time, everyone. <laughs>